Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. It is your queen, divine mother, goddess Yamaya, your intuitive guide. And I am going to be doing an intuitive reading for my sun, moon, and rising signs, specifically for Aquarius. Today is September 28th, 2022. This is going to be a timeless reading. This is going to be on your timeline whenever it's supposed to be on your timeline so guys i can be saying today which i am stating today and you can see this a year from now that will be the time when it was meant for it to find you based on the universe in your situation we have self-esteem it says i possess gifts of the soul that benefit me and others so someone is building up their self-esteem or someone has really high self-esteem or someone could be having self-esteem issues as well. Worry. Someone could be worried at this time as well. It says, I am learning that worry doesn't change an outcome. So some someone could be very much so in their head worried about a situation. They can also be in denial over this. It says, I acknowledge my fear, but I replace it with the insight of awareness. So someone needs to be aware that, you know, they need to build up and work on their self-esteem. Someone could be worried about someone else too much and not be putting time into themselves. Here go the self-esteem card coming out again. It wanted to fly out. So that is definitely confirmation. Someone is worried about someone else's um, self-esteem as well and their level of, um, you know, how they carry themselves as well as how they view themselves. Someone is spending too much time worried about someone else when they should be actually focusing on themselves. Someone has a lot of perseverance. Um, this could be you, Aquarius, or someone else that you are thinking of. It says, I know that I can do whatever I set my mind to do. Someone is definitely a go-getter, has that mentality where they go and, you know, seek something and go after it. Someone else has an issue with doubt. Um, someone is a perseverer. Someone is a doubter. It says, I release the need to know all the answers. So, so someone is releasing their need to know everything or know you know what is taking place what is going on um this could be a capricorn taurus or virgo we also have out here leo aries and sagittarius someone is needing to ground themselves though they need to look at themselves and not seek not seek validation from others we have the death card coming out in reverse it says i am learning that endings are merely beginnings but someone doesn't want an ending to take place which is why someone is viewing someone else's self-esteem as well as you know um their you know perseverance level compared to theirs so there someone is pretty much comparing themselves to someone else because an ending is taking place in their life and they could be confused as to why the ending is taking place or why someone else is choosing someone over them and so they're having a hard time understanding this point of view or what it is about the other person that makes their person or the person of interest that they're thinking about or you're thinking about want this other person it says discipline but it's in the reverse it says i can accomplish what i set my mind to but in reverse so someone doesn't feel like they're um a goal oriented person or they're not someone who's very diligent at what they want to do this is someone who is not a person perseverer with perseverance coming out in the upright you are someone someone is worried that they don't have the perseverance it takes in order for them to complete their goals and go after what they want and then we have trust someone does not trust this either um it says i accept that my inner voice will always guide me correctly but someone doesn't trust their intuition as well so someone has self-esteem issues and they don't trust that you know what someone tells them they doubt a lot what someone tells them about themselves if someone says they're beautiful they don't think that they they're beautiful they don't believe you this is the truth because my ear is ringing so someone um could have a lot of challenges with adversity coming out someone can have a lot of challenges when it comes to their self-esteem as well as well as the way that they view themselves it says i accept that challenges are the best way to learn but someone is doubting um that these challenges are the best way for them to learn someone doesn't want to learn um these challenges that they have to go through someone doesn't see the you know the 
point of why they are having all of these challenges in their life. They don't understand it. They could think that, you know, the world is working against them when really the world is trying to help them to evolve and to grow through these challenges and trials that they're um, taking on. But they're reluctant to take them on. As I was reluctant to say that someone is reluctant to take on their challenges, they're reluctant to grow up. They're reluctant to see the world for what it is. They're reluctant. They're lurking as well. This is someone who could be stalking. You or someone could be stalking someone else. But um, yeah, someone is not believing that they are someone who's worthy of appreciation they're not they're not feeling like they're worthy of the satisfaction of being in someone's presence as well someone is worried that someone else is outdoing them or that, that someone else is more important than them or someone else is you know going to take the um spotlight from them someone is in abundance we have abundance car someone isn't abundant we have the abundance card coming out in reverse it says that i am lim i am a limitless I am a limitless being and I can manifest whatever I desire in this physical reality. So someone is feeling like they're not able to be abundant or they're not able to have what they need or someone could have lost their abundance as well because they were too busy focused on someone else when they should have been focusing on themselves. They were too busy trying to compete with someone else when they should have been, you know, competing with the, the only man in the mirror that they see or woman in the mirror that they see, which is themselves. Someone put too much time and focus into worrying about what someone else had going on instead of you know pouring into their own cups and it actually ended them up in a fucked up or a messed up situation someone is in a lot of denial about things that are occurring in their life or things that are you know taking form in order for them to change someone um needs to be honest with themselves um it says i can't always expect the truth from others but i can expect it from myself yeah someone needs to be honest with themselves and actually learn to appreciate themselves and actually learn to take on these you know I want to say setbacks or I want to say um, as well as these challenges that they're going through. Someone needs to take them on head on and actually, you know, be willing to forgive themselves because they're not able to forgive themselves with the forgiveness card coming out on the um um, reverse on the top of the deck it says i acknowledge that harboring resentment blocks the flow of love yeah but someone is blocking out love at this time someone doesn't want to you know receive or appreciate anything that they have in their life they're de definitely a debbie downer and definitely um going through a lot of you know lack of confidence someone doesn't have the confidence that they need in order for them to you know complete the task that they need to complete as well as to go um set forth in this new journey of self-healing someone doesn't want to do the work someone could be looking for their identity in someone else instead of in themselves someone could be looking for validation from someone else instead of from themselves and so that could be holding them back at this time someone definitely needs to learn how to self-love and self-heal someone is definitely not balanced out and they need to balance themselves out which is why i was sa saying that someone needs to ground themselves but that is what i have for you guys at this time guys you need to learn how to balance yourself out you need to learn how to you know do some self affirmations as well as if this is you but if this is someone else and you know they're just in your energy someone needs to learn how to you know have self-love pretty much and self-care and pretty much do all of the things on the daily that makes you feel good about yourself set goals and complete them even if it's really small ones even if it's only one a day you know learning how to you um if you want to change your diet learning how to drink more water a day learning how to eat more fruits a day learning how to eat more vegetables a day learning how to take walks and things like that at least 30 minutes a day just you know doing those small steps that'll actually end up benefit fitting you later on you'll need to do that in order for you to overcome this setback as well as this self-sabotaging um 
mindset that you have at this time. But that is what I have, guys. Please do thumbs up this video as well as subscribe to the channel by clicking that red subscription button. I love, love, love to have you a part of my soul family. So guys, be sure to be updated on my latest readings by clicking that red subscription button, guys. I love to help you on your journey. I will be seeing you all very much so soon. Until next time, guys, stay safe and stay blessed. Bye.